Good evening and welcome to the November 9, 2017 Budget and Finance Committee meeting. This is an organizational meeting and our first responsibility is to elect a chairman. And could I have nominations please? I'd like to mar uh, nominate Marshall Bullock. Second. 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 <laughs> Any other nominations? I make a motion that they cease. Second. Second. All in favor? Okay. Um, thank you very much. Next is the nomination of a vice chairman. Have nominations, Bob please. Goslin. Bob Goslin. Second. I will accept. Any other nominations? Nominations will cease. Barry, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you made that motion, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> All in favor? Okay, thank you. The next item I have on the agenda is the approval of the minutes of April 18th, 1917. However, I have not read those minutes. Has anybody else? No. I did at the no. time. No. Then you would abstain because yes. you weren't there, but I, I am going to uh, pass on this item for that reason. That nobody's read them. Okay. For the next meeting, I will get those out to you, and, and we'll vote on them yeah, along with this meeting. Okay? Okay. New business. The review and comment on the FY 2016-17 reports. I will comment on those by saying that they are not ready yet. The uh, auditing has sent them back to the town treasurer, and she has a few adjustments to be made. And she is assuming that they will be ready for our review by the end of this month. Okay. I have no reason, unless anybody wants to, to call a meeting specifically to review those notes. I'll send them out when I have them, and we'll catch them on the next go around. Obviously, we will um, communicate by emails if you have any questions on those documents. Okay. The next item is to review and comment on the September 30th first quarter reports. Okay, and I received a couple of comments through email. I think I answered those correctly. Are there any other comments that people want to make on those reports? Yes, Dana. Uh, can I get those reports? Yep. On I want to talk. I'd like to talk to you after the meeting to okay. get into some procedures and get into that. We can do that. How to contact you and so forth. All okay. right. Well, I'd rather do it in. In a public meeting, though, it's just... How would you like to receive these documents? Uh, email, mail. Are you receiving my emails? No. Do you? Would you like to publicly announce your email address? Uh, <laughs> no. Okay, we'll do it after the meeting. Okay. Uh, I have a couple comments on formatting on those reports. One is on the income statements they are carrying negative numbers which to me dilutes the bottom line figure for income for reporting purposes does it did anybody else notice that at all mm -hmm. yeah do you see those debbie on that report yeah. yeah okay i think it would dilute those numbers i think that that would be a, a change that would we would run and recommend to the um treasurer and those would be, that's one of my comments. Does anybody else have any other comments on those reports? Brian, you've always got something to say. Come on. No, I think the, sorry, I have a touch roll in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> knew that that's, we knew that was going to happen. <laughs> um, I think the, there was some formatting changes that I think they finally got to a place now, which is much better. There okay. some yep. things that were missing, but I'm feeling much better about it. The reason these reports have changed, as we all know, is we changed to a trio accounting system. And the report generators that are available need to be massaged so that we can get the numbers the way we want them. And I think we're going down that road correctly. So, okay. Budget and Finance Committee member comment. Anybody want to make any comments on? the processes that we go through, the timings that we go through, any changes that we want to recommend? Maybe, maybe sure. Yep. Just the, the questions about, so we, we with the open position, 
there's eight of us on the right and will that position be filled I cannot say that right now okay. uh, the write-in process is has been rewritten and will be presented to the selectmen on the 14th okay okay uh, where that goes from there I think that would open a door to either take applications and make a, make an appointment which is how I got on this committee mm -hmm. or select another method okay but I think I'd like to defer the a firm answer until after the 14th selectman meeting the reason I was asking yeah. was I and I'm I meant to do this beforehand and um, yep. um, was the question about um, majorities and five to carry the five to carry so five. with eight then it makes it a it makes it just a little bit tougher right. to make sure I mean, I guess what I would say is plead with all of us, including myself, to make sure that we're here for the meeting right. so that we have that right. that number of people. Yep. Unless we want to, I believe, we could change it now if we wanted to make it anything different than That's an carry. ordinance issue, and I have to change the ordinance okay. to do that. Okay. Okay. So Which we, we will consider that as time goes by. If we can just make yep. sure we're all here. Yep. Because if we only have, you know, five of us, then it's like yep. unanimous. <laughs> or if we have four, then we can't carry anything. Yes. Uh, so To clear the record, Four four ties fail. Okay, so if you four vote no and us four vote yes, the motion fails. Okay. So, so you'll be voting on all motions. Usually, I yes. I'll okay. have to, if, if it comes down to it, I will. If, it, it, if it's okay. the nine members here, I usually don't vote. Okay. okay. Um, last year we talked about. Um, refining the ordinance to include the vice chair. For this committee yes <clears throat> and we also talked about eliminating the superintendent of schools as an ex parte or, or an ex officio mm -hmm. to that right and it needs to be cleaned up for gender gender language things like that so. okay 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 I uh, have two I'm sorry Bob I just about the process yep. um, I, I liked s splitting up uh, to two workshop type uh, nights with different committee uh, different town um, departments yep. um, so it kind of spread it out um, eliminates the marathons and right. um, and of course we would be allowed to uh, send questions for these department heads directly through you please through me so that I get everybody on the same page and my answers go from them to me out that way so like an hourglass. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sure. Anything else? I am one that does not like a whole bunch of emails. So I'm going to ask you if you people still would like to receive the GP COG newsletters. I would. What's it actually, called? But I can probably get it from them directly or I can <clears throat> get it from Don or whomever. GP COG. Um, in their infinite wisdom has decided to eliminate Gray and Raymond for some, I don't know why, but the, you know, it's Portland, Falmouth, Cumberland, and all that stuff. So to so me, it has no importance to Raymond. We're no, we're, no we're no longer members then? I forget whether we dropped that or MMA. I think that we dropped MMA. Yeah, it's stayed with GP Club. We were in MMA. So anyway, I, I forget which one that is. We're not in MMA. As I recall, if they just dropped MMA and stayed with and stay okay, so we're in GP COG. We get their newsletters. Uh, to me, they're concentrating all their efforts in the areas of food and transportation along the coastline. I'd be happy to send it out. I just don't want you to feel you're getting buried with emails from me. Go. No, I'm all set. Why, why don't you pass on sending either, it out then, and I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll find okay, another way I'm if I'm interested. That. The other one is Don uh, Willard kindly sends me the MWAC monthly report. That goes right into my other file. Does anybody read that? Anybody interested in how much trash goes through MWAC? Okay. Cut it out. Well, I'd like to know. Uh, yes, sir. Oh, Mr. Okay. Chairman, uh, I was on the... Uh, I represented the town at MWAC, so right. um, I, I'd like to get those reports. Just, you know, to see the numbers. Okay. Please. Yep. We'll, we'll make arrangements to get you those. But Sir, ma'am. If there's anything that we 
some of these reports anyway. Can't we just go to the town hall and ask them for a copy of it? They're on the internet. You can go to the MWAC website and get the internet. Get get it right there. You can go to the GPCOG website and, and just get it, get it right. For, okay. Is it on the town website? The MWAC report? Is no. A link to it? No. It could be a link to MWAC, but it's not there. I suppose we could we do can, that. Yeah, we can ask you to put a link on there if you guys want to do that and just attach it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, here's the meat of tonight's meeting. Next next Tuesday night, the uh, budget, the selectmen will be presented with the dates for budget reviews for next year. So if you have your calendars, I'll give you the dates. Yep. <laughs> If you remember, in years past, we used to meet in, in mid-December for the reasons we're meeting now. I've, I've tried to move that off December for the holiday reasons and stuff like that. So our, Thank you. our first meeting will be joint review one, and it will be set for February 27th in this building. Six o'clock? Six o'clock. The that intention is to have the budget packages in our possession by the 13th, yeah, which I will get them out to you two February. weeks ahead of time. So the packages will be ready on the 13th. I'll get them out to you. The first meeting will be the 27th of February. The second review, department will be review. sending this out, right? But I'm just verifying that those dates. I'll be are sending out once the, once the selectmen approve it. Yes. Okay. Okay. March 13th. Part of the reason for me to bring it up to see if there's a big Last conflict year. here. Yep. Yep. Okay. So February 27th, March 13th. The, the joint workshop between us and the select board will be on March 27th. The selectmen will meet on April 11th to approve the warrants. And our meeting to approve the warrants will be set for April 17th. Sorry, when was the select board one? Apologize. Tax April day. 11. 11, and then we're going to be on 17. Tax day. And then June 12th is the town meeting this year. And then June what? June 12th is the town meeting. This is a tentative schedule. Um, does anybody have any serious conflicts with this? Much. I don't see any. I'll be in Florida. Okay. When okay. is town meeting? It's June 12th. 12th. Okay, the selectmen will approve this on next Tuesday and I'll get it up to you. Okay, Okay, that's all I have. Is there any public comment? Seeing no public, there'll be none. I just asked you to and put it on the town page for you guys to get links to. Okay, that's fine. We can do that. Dana, if you'd stay with me for a couple minutes, we can go over some procedural okay. details. Sorry, yes. to, sorry to do mm -hmm. a quick Columbo here. I'm wondering, if, would it be worthwhile to have a meeting in January? Because um, I love meetings. Um, yeah, I know, and I, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. For, for one purpose, which is for us to all really get up to speed on where we are year to date. So you're going to be through six months of, and I know we could do that individually, but I'm wondering if we could kind of collectively get our questions together to get to, to, <coughs> the, to the two, um, for, the, for the two root views. And I, and I think there's a value in, in doing it collectively where we can kind of just discuss it and really look at it together because there's a, there's a I'm wisdom open that to, comes. I'm open to that. Um, just a thought. The timing would be in January we would have available this first six months of this year to review. Yeah, I just think it's a, that would be a, it's not would put us in a good, a good place for being able to really kind of be ready for the, 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 the two joints. Yeah. And maybe we limit it to an hour and a half or something like that so we don't run Just all like night. a review. Okay. Everybody in the pool? Yeah. Okay. I'll set a date. It'll be the second or third week of January, probably the third week. Okay. If that's Great. okay. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks, everybody. I think You're welcome. It could be helpful. Okay. Anything else? 
Motion to adjourn. Second. Second. All in favor? And thank